Hey everybody. Yeah, I'm here in a field and I just made Creole Shepherd's Pie. A great, hearty, tasty, filling trail meal, whether you're going down the trail or you're going down the road. And yeah, sometimes you're cooking in the middle of a field because not all of your adventures are to the top of a thing or to the end of a thing or looking at a beautiful lake or river. You're here and you need to eat. So let's get cooking this Creole Shepherd's Pie because it is super tasty and man, it's right in here and I'm hungry. Hey yo, Chef Corso, Outdoor Eats. I'm here to put you on the path to amazing meals on your outdoor treks, even if those outdoor treks lead you to a field somewhere in Virginia. I am here at Overland Expo, finishing up a great weekend teaching workshops. And if you've never been to an Overland Expo, here is what it looks like. It is a bunch of people getting together, traveling from all around the country, meeting and seeing all the new rooftop tents, the tow behind rigs, all the rope and rescue material you could possibly want. And I'm here teaching, teaching, and I'm here teaching workshops, having a great weekend. We've got a little bit of wind going on here tonight. I'm wagging my spatula because we are gonna make something super, super tasty for dinner here tonight. We are making Creole Shepherd's Pie. This is a great car camping recipe or a great backpacking recipe for like night one or night two for your backpacking trip. You know, you don't necessarily wanna take all this stuff for, for a super long backpack. Really, really great recipe. So let's take a look at our ingredients for our Creole Shepherd's Pie. All right, so here are our ingredients. We've got andouille sausage. We've got some celery. We've got a bell pepper that I almost forgot. We have some instant mashed potatoes. We have French's fried onions, corn nuts. Yes, corn nuts can go in your dishes. Old Bay seasoning, Old Bay all day and some cheese snacks. You can add cheese, not add cheese, and if you want it a little bit hotter, you can throw in some hot sauce. Let's get cooking.
Michael.